Hello everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. Let's start with new video. Today we are going to talk about comprehension. What is comprehension? Why comprehension is very important part of our syllabus? What is unseen passages? And why it becomes very important? Yes, dear student, before talking about comprehension and unseen passages, subscribe my channel Vibrating Dhimta. Like, share and comment let's understand the comprehension first what is comprehension see comprehension means understanding comprehension actually comes from the latin term comprehension which means a seizing when you have comprehension of a subject you have seized information right you understood information and incorporate it into your own knowledge any kind of mental grasping of an idea or a subject is a kind of comprehensions right ability to identify main idea and key details ability to sequence a passage into an ordinal series ability to answer direct recall questions and ability to make inferences and uh, or prediction etc identify unfamiliar vocabulary are some important points when we crack it down dear student there are some indispensable points which we should keep in our mind while we attempt this question this is a question which has more than five six or sometime more than seven paragraph which makes it very large how to crack it down and how to solve this large question becomes a riddle for some student especially those who are not good in language whose vocabulary is not rich in such situations there are some very important points sabse pehle aapko is question ko read karna hota hai and you have to read this question with great speed so that you could solve this question in a limited time jab aap ise pad rahe ho you have to pay full attention and full concentration so that you could understand that what are you reading during this process of reading you have to underline the important points important ideas even sentences because these will help you later when you will give the answer of the question that will come later next one is when you are reading this passage there will be some difficult word how to crack it down is again very easy to crack and to understand the meaning of that difficult word you have to read and you have to relate this difficult word with the line which comes just before it and the line coming after this difficult word right you will crack it down after understanding the passage and its central idea and cracking down the difficult word from the passage our next task is to give the answer of these questions jab bhi hum in questions ke answer dete hain our language should be simple right if you are using some words from your vocabulary stay connected with the theme story and the material given in the passage so that it couldn't mar the beauty of your answer and your answer should be to the point logical reasonable brief relevant right we should not use relevant irrational illogical material in our answers because it can mar the beauty of our answer dear student these were some very basic points which we should apply while we attempt this question kabhi kabhi hame ye question first reading mein samajh nahi aata so we can go one more time even more than two times yes hum aisa kar sakte hain but keep in your mind that this is really a big question and it takes time so how to crack it down in a very limited time that's what you have to keep in your mind because there is no shortcut to crack this question except understanding the central idea of the passage now move on high altitude climbing is still a very dangerous task in spite of the availability of oxygen masks and other protective equipment which modern climbers take with them these of course are indispensable accessories of climbing but more important than these is the stamina of climber which ultimately determines the success of his attempt throughout his journey death is his constant companion which he can keep at a distance 
only with his superb presence of mind. He has to tread every inch of the ground with the utmost care, for a false step may not only strike him a fatal blow, but also bring disasters to the whole expedition. That is why all expeditions invariably take with them the local guides who are experienced climbers and who have a thorough knowledge of the nature of the terrain. Moreover, a huge amount of capital is needed for financing these expeditions and this is generally provided by governments or rich private organizations. The primary object of a mountaineering expedition is to get to the top of a high mountain, which in the past has withstood all attempts to conquer it. But it should not be presumed that the expedition is a complete failure if it does not reach its destination. Sometimes operations are temporarily suspended because of bad weather, loss of some valuable equipment or the sudden death of a very important member of the party. Every big expedition takes with it men who are interested in botany, geology, geology and various other branches of science and these men carry with them equipment for recording their observations concerning the weather, the terrain, the different forms of life in higher altitudes. Other scientists, explorers and expeditionists utilize the fruits of their observations. Thus, every unsuccessful expedition contributes to the success of later expeditions. The British expedition led by Colonel Hunt would have found their way to Everest much more difficult had not the earlier expeditions armed them with useful knowledge about the death-dealing weather which they had to encounter in the vicinity of the summit. To ordinary people, mountaineering need not be a fearful journey in the land of snowstorms, where the brave adventurer is always face to face with death. They can scale less ambitious heights, rest their weary limbs under a quiet shelter and feast their eyes on the distant landscape. In the company of friends, they can enjoy an outing near a waterfall or cross into the next valley with have a sex full of provisions dangling from their shoulders. All those who can afford to go to a hill station would seek this innocent pleasure, for it can be had without any risk to life or limb. This was your unseen passage. Now before going ahead, let's discuss some very important difficult words from the passage. Equipment, things that needed for a particular purpose. Kisi bishesh kaam ke liye kaam mein aane wali cheeze. Indispensable, absolutely essential or very important. Accessories, extra things that are useful. Stamina, capacity, right? Capacity for physical or mental endurance. Superb, supremely excellent. Tread, walk, fatal, causing death. Disaster means terrible accident. Expeditions, people making an organized journey. Invariably, always, terrain is a stretch of land with regard of its natural features. Bhuvak, right? Withstood, resisted, opposed, birodh, you know. Presume, supposed to be true. Okay, sahi maan lena. Destination, a place to which one is going. Manjil, botany, scientific study of plants. Geology, scientific study of the earth. Geology, scientific study of animals. Encounter means face, vicinity, the area around a place. You know, Ados Pados. Summit, the highest point. Shikhar, ambitious, demanding a lot of effort to reach. Weary, tired, thaka hua. Have a sec. Canvas bag, jhola, you know, I would say. Provisions, supplies of food and drinks, etc. Dangling. You know, hanging loosely, khule mein jhulta hua, are some difficult from the passes. Now, let's see. After grasping the meaning of this difficult word, 
and understanding the central idea of this passage we are capable of giving the answer of these questions see the first question is here what are the factors that determine the success of the climber a climbers ki safalta kaun se factor nishchit karti hai there are so many factors which determines the success of the climbers protective equipment stamina presence of mind knowledge of the terrain are some important factors that determine the success of the climbers second what precautions should the climbers take during their journey जर्नी के दौरान एक क्लाइंबर्स को किस तरह के प्रिकॉशंस लेने की जरूरत रहती है यस दे शुड हैव विद देम लोकल गाइड्स हु आर एक्सपीरियंस क्लाइंबर्स दे शुड ट्रेड एवरी इंच ऑफ द ग्राउंड विद आउटमोस्ट केयर थर्ड इन व्हाट वेज डज ए माउंटेनियरिंग एक्सपेडिशन कंट्रीब्यूट टू द वेल्थ ऑफ नॉलेज यस माउंटेनियरिंग in every big expedition record their observations concerning the weather the terrain and different forms of life in higher altitudes these observations can be very useful for other scientists and explorers number 4 how is an ordinary mountaineer experience different from that of a regular expedition regular expedition say sadharan mountaineering kaise alag hai kaise inka anubhav alag hai See an ordinary mountaineering is not faced with any fatal dangers it is just a sort of picnic or outing for him number 5 which is really very important how does a local guide help an expedition a local guide has a thorough knowledge of the terrain that is why he help the climber a lot thus he can be of great help to an expeditions these were some important question from this passage now one very important question is where we have to find out similar or sometime opposite of the word here we have like we have that area of lands right it's similar word terrain we can find out in the para number 1 and second is peak peak means submit right it's similar submit you can find in the para number 2 the city student these were some question from this passage and all the question which has been taken from this passage iske answer hame is passage ke different different para se easily mil sakte hai while you answer that time you can make little change and that change can be made by using some words from your own vocabulary but stay connected with the theme and the material given this in this passage rest of the important points has already mentioned that how to understand the passage how to crack the difficult word how to mark important lines and how to connect different ideas together in your answer and how many words are sufficient to make your answer perfect and how you should avoid right illogical irrational irrelevant material in the answer that's it dear student see you soon in the next video till then stay safe stay healthy